and welcome to Wild Brick Collector. My name is Mike. I am here to share my Lego passion by sharing my Lego collection. What do we got today? Atari. Hmm, interesting. This one is part of the Icons series, and it is set number 10306 called Atari Video Computer System. Ooh, big title. <laughs> this set comes in at 2,532 pieces. There is one minifigure hidden somewhere in here. Set came out in 2022, uh, selling for $239.99, which is about nine cents a piece ish. So 2,500 pieces. 240 bucks though. So yeah. So according to Lego's website, it was called ready player one. Um, yeah. So what do you think? The Atari 2600, um, pairs nicely actually with that, uh, NES system, the Nintendo entertainment system that came out, uh, 2020, I believe. Um, so yeah, what do we got? The, uh, specs on this guy, the Atari's 50th anniversary. Holy smokes. It's been around for 50 years. Atari was founded in 1972 on September 11th, 1977. Um, and uh, that's when uh, the Atari 2600 came out. Um, do you remember Pong? Does anybody remember Pong? Um, yeah, it's a thing. So, yeah, um, it does come with the uh, three most popular cartridges cartridge um asteroids adventure and centipede asteroids adventure centipede see which way i got them in there um and there are also three little scenes that um are in a, a compilation with it here so um what do we got let's uh take ourselves a closer look and uh, take ourselves into the Wayback Machine. Atari 2600. It's pretty much a one-to-one -one ratio on it. Um, I did have a 2600 myself, and this is exactly what it looked like. Um, the wood grain going on on the front. Um, there are some really nice um, pre-printed plates all on the top here for your um, power TV type. Do you have a color TV? Do you have a black and white TV? Spoiler, keep that closed. Color or black and white. Wow. So you can flip the switch to black and white. There's your cartridge controller there or input. What do we got? Our game select. So that one does have a nice little rubber piece that does push it back up. And then um, game reset. So push that and it does come back up. These first two do lock into place up and down. So I want to turn the game on. Ooh, she's on now. Oh, wait, I don't have a cartridge in there. So I'm going to flip it back to color TV because I did have a color TV. Let's put in Centipede Atari. So big old sticker on the front, of course, but uh, it's a perfect graphics. That's exactly what you wanted to see. Centipede, it is another sticker. So let's pop her right in there. Oh, yeah, and I don't know. You couldn't probably hear it, but it does actually click into place. Um, yeah, let's uh, pull it back out, push it back in again, and it does click really nice into place. So let's pull that out, put it back into here. Got your other three cartridges. And, um, yeah, we were talking about the uh, little scenes that it comes with. Centipede. So there's a little centipede build with some mushrooms going on. And adventure. I never actually played adventure. So um, little castle thing going on, I guess. I don't know much about adventure. However, this guy right here, asteroids. Um, I like this little mini build here. Um, where'd the uh, thing go? It fell off. Um, this is like my favorite part that fell off. I got to put them back on here real quick for you guys. Um, see if I can get it on there. So that's our little spaceship and he's shooting the asteroids and there's one blowing up right here. Can you see that? Um, one of my favorite games ever. So we can put that back there. And, um, uh, yeah, well, I guess I'm going to have to move him again now for our little spoiler alert. 
Oh, I'm so sad it like opened up. So we do this and pull out the scene. There's our minifigure dude. It's a little um child that is playing um the video game system right here. So it's a 1980s um room. I think that's what it, did I write that down right? Um, that can't be right because well it came out in '77. So yeah, the kid probably didn't get it right away. Early '80s then. So we got our uh, boombox. There's a VCR tape right there. What's a VCR tape? And uh, some posters going on here. Old school phone hanging on the wall. Cute little kitty cat hanging out there. So yeah, it's a real retro um, scene of a kid's room. Little bookshelf. It's really nice. So it does fold up all into there and have that action to come back up. So we'll put it all back together there. And uh, for reference, I'm going to pull out another one of the cartridge. Um, you can see the uh, interior of the cartridge. And here's the, um, I do have the NES system too, um, Lego set, of course. So it is like a one-to-one -one ratio on that. Check out the different versions of the cartridges there. So, uh, yeah, I like the uh, Super Mario. Um, did I do a review on that set yet or not? I don't remember. Um, upside down Atari. So I kind of wish I actually had have had had had. Is that right? I wish I had one of these um, little bookshelf things for my cartridges. Mine were just kind of sitting around collecting dust. You know, um, I don't know if you remember or not, um, uh, but. <sighs> Make sure you get that dust off and then put it back in there. It's not working. It's fuzzy. Pull that out. Give that a blow. Stick it back in there. And you're ready to play, right? Um, oh, yeah, I didn't really talk about the controller. Like I said, one-to-one -one basically controller. One button, joystick. Can you do that nowadays? I don't know. Um, so it's a nice uh, pre-printed uh, tile that goes around it there. And um, there's a nice rubber piece in the middle so um, you can really get that feel of playing the game again. So you can see, check that out. Oh, this is just, it's perfect. Put it in my hand and actually um, brings back a lot of memories of the day. Oh, wow. Here's our box, um, big giant box. What's our playability factor, factors going on? You can see all the little mini scenes, the kids' room. Um, oh, yeah, there was a um, rubber uh, wire hose. This guy right here, I don't know if you can see it. That did connect from here to the back. Um, my cat destroys anything um, chewable like that, so I don't have it on there. Um, but I do have it. Uh, otherwise, uh, yeah. Beautiful shelf display, one-to-one -one ratio. Did you get it? Did you want it? Did you have one? Do you remember what that is? Do you know what a VCR tape is? Do you know what a cartridge is instead of a download? Um, <laughs> asteroids. That was a lot of fun. What do you think? Uh, throw out a like and a subscribe and a comment or two. Hit the button. Do it. You know you want to. Really appreciate it.